Hello and welcome to Minds of Money Hong Kong. I'm with Pete Landau, the Executive Director of Liquid Platinum. Welcome, Pete. Thanks, John. Pleasure to be here. First of all, can you please provide an update on the Zinjin Mining Group transaction? Absolutely. But as you know, uh, Zinjin are the largest gold producer listed uh, out of China, both uh, Hong Kong and, and Beijing. We recently announced that they are the final tranche of $13 million is scheduled to be completed by 31 March, so obviously Monday. Uh, we are on track for that completion. Uh, and they've also announced the intention where, where Zinjin will immediately become the second biggest shareholder in Anque. So basically we are almost there. There's only uh, one or two compliance documents to complete. But as, as announced, we are on schedule to complete by 31 March, which is uh, Monday. Following completion of the deal, how long would it take to receive the funds and when would mine construction start? OK, so there's two components. So with, with the $13 million coming in and, and a subsequent deal, Enquire will have about 18 to $20 million in cash. Now that will then be used to do all pre, pre-approved mine work, um, but there still does need to be a major mine financing, which is scheduled to be negotiated over, over Q2, Q, early Q3, which, you know, there's potential capex on, these pro- on this project's about $500 million. So what will happen once the effective $20 million comes in, we will then immediately commence all development, pre-development work, and then during probably May or June, we'll then be announcing the major project financing uh, for the Garatau project. Can you please outline the projected production timeline? So timeline is project financing in place June, July, so let's say Q3. Full on development, as in pre-development already done, full development commence Q4. And then you're probably going to have, depending on you do it, but conservatively probably a two year, a two year development stage before being in a position to, uh, to, to produce ore. And then on the concentrator side, it depends whether we toll treat initially or use our own concentrator. That, that's still to be determined in the final stages, but two years from Q4 is, is, is your best guess. Finally, Pete, can you please outline some of the key catalysts for investors to look out for during 2014? So, obviously, next week is the key catalyst with, with the Zinjin, the $20 million tranche as it has been completed. Uh, next one will then be uh, updated bankable feasibility study and pre-development work, and then the major one will be the, the, the project financing. Uh, which obviously will, will, will involve a, a significant portion of debt uh, and that is to be negotiated with Zinjin over the next three to four, you know, probably the next three months. So main one next week, uh, completion of Zinjin, then the, uh, the updated BFS and then the, uh, the project financing and obviously commencement of development uh, in Q4. Thank you, Pete, for joining us at Minds & Money Hong Kong. Cheers, John. Thank you.